Welcome back, survivors. I'm the Survival This, and we return to Dino System, where we are setting off really, really well. We are into late winter right now, and I think once we get into tomorrow, we might actually be at the start of a brand new year. So I'm just trying to think of what we want to exactly work on. We've got ourselves rather well situated with things. I don't know if we still have... Oh yeah, we got plenty of meat in the back here, so we'll probably actually have... I don't know, I think we actually, all we really have to do is sleep now. Sleep, let our bars kind of regenerate, and see where we're holding up. Well, yeah, this might be the last night of this year. We might be into year two now. Well, we'll just wait and let everything kind of play out. So there's not really too much left to do with the series, aside from maybe try taming. So, like I say, we're probably going to start shrinking down how much Dino System is on the channel. Ooh. I guess we'll sleep in the bedroll. Oh, no, not that. There we go. So, Dino System will probably still go up once per week, at least. I'm probably thinking every Sunday. Dino System Sunday kind of has a nice little ring to it. And I also want to do some other new series, get those going on the channel, and also try to grow us out a bit more. So, the Isle... I was hoping to try to get one or... Well, around two episodes per week, but I'm probably only be going down to one. Unfortunately, I wasn't exactly able to get as steady with things as I thought I'd be. Oh. Uh, we'll eat a bit of food, and I guess we'll get some more sleep if we can. Oh, no, not tired, so maybe you're not. Well, might as well put the cape on. And what do we want to do now? Oh, uh, let me see. 65, 65, 82. That's doing okay. The thatch, I think, is... Yeah, the thatch is doing really well. This thatch is still doing well, too. I don't really know what we'll do next. Let's see, food and Mo, I think, are still doing okay. Well, Mo was somewhere. Oh, is he up over here? Yeah, there's Mo. Looks like Mo's actually grown a bit, too, so that's good to see. I really don't know what we're going to do. We did see the Tyrannosaur nest up over there. Actually, I might try gathering dung and putting together more pieces of wall, but my problem I have... Oh, maybe that's just ambience from the pond. I thought I was hearing something else moving about. Yeah, maybe what I'll try to do is gather up some of the dung and make ourselves more walls. Yeah, you know, that's because I was thinking about maybe making a corral of sorts if we do find a troodon we can tame. And we do want to be careful just because we do have some of the dinos and triceratops around. Bob is just doing okay there. There's Jackass. We'll... Definitely need to keep an eye on him. Now, I don't know if it was because he was in heat the other time or not. Oh, yeah, well, that one is for sure. I have to pay a little more attention to when we look into their status, because I think it might have... I know one of the commenters said that it looked like he might have been in heat when he attacked us, so that could very well have been the case, and I was just too blind to actually look and see. There we go, we'll grab those. And I think it's... I can't remember if it's five or not. That's just a stump. Uh, there's Mo there, but he's not really dropped anything beside him. I guess hibernation slowed down all bodily functions of them, so that way there's not really going to be any extra dung about. Uh, let's just take a quick look and see. Stone wall, we need five. Yeah, so we're till t ah, still two away. It is my first recording of... Oh, there's a piece. My first recording of the morning. And it's probably going to be quite a few recordings if I can squeeze them in. I'm actually aiming to try to get about six things, six episodes total across three series done. Oh, there's Betty. Just going to try to be careful and look around some of the trees and that. Really hoping we would have found another piece or two. But I've got the two dino systems to do, the last two episodes of Carnivore's Triassic to also do, as well as a few more episodes of Subnautica, probably two or three. So maybe actually seven in total, but I'll have to see how my voice holds out through it all. I think as long as I basically keep Dino System and Subnautica on the channel, that kind of meets that little survival quality I like to keep for the channel about going through and exploring some games. I also do have to get some others. The Isle... It's kind of iffy it would be or not, it, because you don't really have the crafting shelter component of it. You really only have food and water to really manage, well, food, water, and health, but... 
I suppose you could probably squeeze it in and say it might be a survival-esque game. Oh, excuse me. Just had water, but that's still enough to make me hiccup a little bit here and there. That's three. Come on, we need two more. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that's five big rocks. We'll just move over here. And I'll see if I can find another thing of dung quickly. I don't know if we will or not. For as much dung as you need, it really seems like it's actually pretty rare to be able to find. And he's just running off to find water. So we'll give him a bit of wood there. I thought he was looking for water. Yeah, so he's looking for a rival, so we'll try to keep clear of him a bit. I am quite surprised how hard it is to come across dung, even when you have a few animals out and about like this. It basically means you're really restricted on if you can make stone walls or not. Not to mention also the durability and how quickly that goes down, too. It almost seems like you need an entire herd just to be able to get the amounts you need. Yeah, not finding anything from around them. It is still cool, so it's not too bad thanks to the pelt cape, but we will want to mine that a little bit. Also soreness. Ah, that's gone down. Strength has actually gone up quite a bit. It's sitting in 93 now. That's pretty good. Yeah, I don't really just can't find anything else I'm looking for. There's Jackass there looking for a rival, so we'll just kind of sneak and be mindful of him. I think we should be fine. Just grab ourselves a drink. Oh, come on, you god. Even when I'm fucking sneaking, they tick detect me like that. I suppose this at least trains up our athletics. Yeah, so he shouldn't know where I am, so that's at least good. You can at least hide down here, but like, god damn, screw you, jackass. I swear, we... How are we doing on toughness? Uh, it's going up there, which is nice, so we might have to maybe look at taking him down. He's just getting to be a real nuisance for us. I suppose what we'll do, though, is put that down and get a little more sleep. Never mind, we'll have to put that on and try to get to sleep. Never mind, we still gotta warm up first. Just let me get another drink. Okay, oh, well, the sun is coming up, so maybe we'll try... No, oh, no, or day 36, so still in late winter, so it'll still be another day, I suppose. Oh, spring is in the air, so that probably means tomorrow we'll see it arrive. We'll just sleep, let our bars all go up if they will. Yeah, we'll just have to eat once we wake up, but even then, that's still no problem. Metabolism went up, insulation was superb, everything's looking really good. Yeah, we're feeling great, we'll put that back, have a bit to eat. Open the door, and start making our way out. No, let me guess. Yeah, there's Jackass. He doesn't want to go very far from around here, which not exactly great for us. No, well, but I do see a piece of dung that would be helpful to grab. Oh, of course, you got to rest right on it. Well, okay, fine then. We'll start looking around at a few other things. Nothing over here. I guess we'll do some far scouting to see. There's not really much all that really down and around here, though. There are the Tyrannosaurs back up at Gabriel's Rest, where I don't know how they are for things. Oh, they're actually fighting one another. This may be our chance to get rid of Jackass. 
You know what? I think I am going to do that. He's been such a pain. And he's going to be really low health now. Where's our axe? Your time has come. Good work, Bob. And we will run away. Seth is chasing me. You're the new alpha, Bob, but I'll let you have your bit of... So we'll use the rock now. Try to sneak a bit. Yes, they are going to keep chasing me, but maybe I can lose them around somewhere. Jack asked got us so many times, though I have no regrets about doing that. I don't know how far away these guys will chase me, but it looks like they might even fall me. I should be fine if I can skirt around Pyre Peak here into the Land of Ashes. But, you know what, I feel pretty good about getting that strike in. Jack asked took us... Tried to take us a couple of times, so that rules him out of the way. And now we are going to have plenty of meat and pelts to keep us good for a long time. And we even got the other Triceratops out of the area, so that way we don't have to worry about them being an issue either. Why is it that the spontaneous decisions that I don't thoroughly think through seem to be the best, yet the ones that I try to think through the longest and then act on always bite me in the ass? Like... I guess it's trust your gut and just do what that says in this case. Well, we can come right back down and start ourselves on cleaning up that nice big Triceratops kill. We don't want to leave it for too long because we might get in some Troodons or Tyrannosaurs, but... I think we'll have quite a bit of time to be able to clean and carve it up. So we don't want to use the... Axe for that. We'll probably use... Uh, you know what, maybe we'll use that one and a sharp stone. There's a small one. I know we're probably going to lose the dung, but I'd rather focus more on just getting this all cleaned up and good to go. So let's start entirely on the meat, and oh boy, we're going to have a lot to carve off. 21 pieces. And basically it's like a little jackpot we hit here. I really do have to thank Bob for being such a good sport about taking this one down so far. Oh, well, there goes the axe. We'll use that small sharp stone and see how we do for... No, oh, yeah, we'll probably... No, we'll take this back. I don't know how quickly it will spoil, but we should be able to just sort of leave it in cover in that. And we'll just spend a, probably a whole day just cooking it all up nice and ready. Ooh, actually, I'll have to grab some wood. Branch, another piece of wood. Some more branches. We'll drop that in there. Grab a sharp stone big, and maybe another small one. There's a nice quality. You know what, we will just close that door up there. Just in case we do have something kind of comes around and doesn't rip apart all of our new earnings. But yeah, this turned out pretty damn well. We're going to get... I don't know how quickly it's going to decay, like what's it at? It's 99% and it is starting to freeze. I don't know if that would preserve it more or damage it more. Ooh, more thunder snow, but yeah, we're going to be set for a long time with all this in now. Oh, looks like Moe's active again. Food might be starting to get active in it just a bit, too. So we'll just get this down to, say, the 10 bits of meat left. 
There we go. This will be the last one we'll carve off. Then we'll bring all of our earnings back into the base. How many can I hold? Two? This looks like I can only hold about four at a time. So you know what? We will put these down, open the door, and leave it open. Just so that way we can get the most in. So I don't think we're going to have anything too quickly come on over. And you know what? Maybe just so that way we do work on our athletics a bit. One, two, three. Nope. Oh. Looks like I didn't quite get the full 10 off that time, but that's good news, was we can take off little chunks at a time then. Now, you know what, let me put my cape on, just so that way I am nice and warm as we keep this up. Ooh, soreness has gone up a bit, though. Definitely keep that in mind. Take the sharp stone again. And we'll work at getting four pieces off at a time, since that's our limit of what we can carry back. Like, the pelt, the tendons I'm not really super necessary about, and there's so many pelts there, it's okay if we do lose a couple due to just... Uh, oh, come on, I'm trying to think of it. What's the word? Decomposition, that's it. I was trying to think, deterioration, close, but not quite, decay, no, it's longer than that. Decomposition is the word, though. Yeah, just get another drink, ooh. Probably use this as our last one, so there's basically a nice even thing of five. Okay, so one, two, three, four... Then we'll take these back, get ourselves a drink. Ah, uh, you know what, uh, drink and some food. We've used up the last of our cooked meat, but we're going to have a whole lot more in a little while. I'm just going to have to make sure that we actually do have enough firewood to be able to cook everything. Because we're going to be eating and cooking good for a long time to come now. Well, yeah, this is actually pretty worn down on the quality it has to it now. Yeah, there's the sharp stone gone, so we'll probably take these in. We'll leave those two down there, and we'll probably take a new sharp stone down with us. Should I light the fire now? Damn. No, it might not be a bad idea, so we'll put the kelp, the cape down, grab some more wood. I think this should keep the fire going for quite some time. All the meat we're going to just drag over here, and then kind of one at a time, put on, take off. Actually, no, no, maybe what we'll do is we'll try two or three at a time. We'll try to remember where each piece is. Okay, so there's that one there, and I found a second one. Come on, where is just that other small stone? I picked two off. There we go. Not best quality. Okay, let's see if we can light this fire quickly. Oh, god damn it. Oh, you know what? Where's one of these little guys? Ah, uh, you have a lot of good quality to you. Come on, just light that fire up, and then we can start doing a lot of cooking. Almost there. Just a little more. Perfect. Okay, so one, two, three. Yeah, maybe we'll try four pieces at a time. And we basically just have to sit here, rest a bit. Oh, there's our first one. There's our second one. There's our third one. And, oh, there's our fourth one there. 
Yes, maybe we will just do three at a time, so that way we don't lose too bad track things. Plenty of fuel in there. That should go nice and steadily. That one's cooked. It's still going. That one's cooked. That one's cooked. Those are still going. Toss another one on. So let's see if I can kind of ease those back a little more. Yeah, I know we're exhausted. We just have a little bit more to go, though. another one. Okay, we're really minding the stamina down quite a bit. Okay, good. We're into the last few here. There we go. Once these three are all done, we can get a nice good bit of rest in. And what the hell, we'll have a bit of meat. Got some more in our system. We've earned ourselves a little bit of a snack from all we've done so far. Oh, that's cooked. And this last one, just a little bit more to go. There we go. Now we'll get some extra sleep. Everything's looking very good for our stomach, although, ooh, we are going to overheat in here. I didn't think of that. Yeah, not going to be our best sleep because of it being so hot in the bedroll, but... Oh, and there we are. We're into early spring now, so we should see it roll over to day... Th yeah, there's day 37. So one year in Dino System takes 36 days. That's something for everybody to know if they're trying to make it for that first year mark. Everything's going along nice and steadily. We won't have any more food. We're just going to go down and get ourselves a nice drink. There we are, that's done. Muscle soreness is a little high still, but I think it's enough to let us keep working and get some more off. Yeah, so here's the frozen carcass. Probably means that we've lost a few things on it, but we'll see. No, oh, no, still looks like there's four to go. I think that was about where we were. Yeah, it is harder to clean off the pieces though, so it'll probably... Actually, it th should be thawing out rather soon. Yeah, there it is, defrosting right now. Actually, if I do have the fire still going, we might even cook up these last four pieces. And the tendons, as much as we get a lot of... Oh, there's Moe's up and about. Good to see that hibernation's ended for him. Food, though, seems to... No, just sleeping. Okay, so that's all of the meat done. Let's bring that all back. There we go. No, we are still bleeding a bit. But let's see if there's still a fire going. I don't think so. I think that... No, no, maybe still is. Yeah, still is. So, you know what? Let's add a little bit more. And we actually... We might be running out of our firewood stock, but I think we should be okay. All that we really have left are the pieces of dung in there. Ah, well, we do have some resin. Well, let's just let all this cook up. We probably will have another piece, and then we'll be back at trying to get some more things off of the Triceratops. Jackass, you may have been a jackass in life, but you were a saint in death, so thank- oh lord. What is with this now? I can't see anything. Uh, 
Okay, you know what? Let's pack up the bedroll if we can. Just so that way the fire will slowly work its way down to being out. Another snack. And now we can shut the door up. There we go. Max strength is up to 95 now. Ooh, we are bleeding a little bit, though. Ah, do, do Let's see. Yeah, it's still cold. So you know what? Let's grab the sharp stone and try getting off a few pelts. Maybe... I guess... You know what? We'll probably pause here, actually, and leave this episode right here. And now, once with this basically done, yeah, a lot of all of our progress for Dino System has really been met. So, thank you guys very much for joining me on another episode of Dino System. We do have sort of the last of the two per week coming up tomorrow. I think all it really is going to be is making that luxury kind of backpack of sorts and ending things off there for a bit. It will still be once a week and we'll probably see about trying to tame the Troodons or a Troodon. But for now, I think we've really tapped out a lot of what the game has to offer. But thank you all for joining me on this wonderful playthrough of Dino System once again. If you do like the series, be sure to leave a comment or a like letting me know. I always appreciate any feedback my viewers can give me. And if you do want to help us out, we are still trying to get up to our 100 subscriber milestone. So if you want to support us, we're more than welcoming new subs every day. Until next time I see you, those survivors, please remember to take care and stay alive.